once my teacher asked me to participate in a storytelling competition it was my first time and i was a little bit nervous so i got courage and went on the stage everything was fine until i saw a kid laughing at me i was dumb i started looking at the other kids who were listening to me i found out everyone was giggling and i didn't have any options but to stay at the stage and memorize my lines few moments later i was blind i rushed to the backstage it was the worst day in my life i never felt so hopeless about me earlier this remarkable moment changed my life forever you must be thinking how yeah so here i am in front of you presenting a ted talk isn't it a paradox and guess what i'm here to talk about hmm you got it right i am going to talk about how to be confident and do away with stage fright so hello ladies and gentlemen my name is shubham today i will talk about five mantras that will definitely turn you up into a confident speaker throughout my journey to be a public speaker i found these tricks i learned these tricks i learned these five tricks and they really work for me first be kind to yourself nobody can love you more than yourself don't be hard on yourself when you can when you make mistakes love yourself as much as you can this is the route to confidence next practice self assured body language it is not ju- just what you speak people will always judge you by the way you present yourself in front of them it means dress up well use body movements use body movements hand gestures facial expressions this gives an aura of confidence to your personality then set goals for yourself if you are really ambitious about becoming a confident speaker then you must set goals for yourself give a daily dose of small goals and try to accomplish it on time for practice more to be the to be constant is the key practice practice and practice more this will only lead you to a positive outcome in addition to it practice in front of the mirror in the camera to keep a check on your body language moreover never pressurize yourself we are sailing on the same boat nobody is going to judge you as we all go through the same experiences so hold your heads just high and just begin stress will only turn you into a hopeless and into a decent person at last i would like to conclude with the lines of bernard ambrush an american financier be who you are say what you feel because those who don't matter and those who matter don't mind so yeah you must do the thing you can you think you cannot do thank you